Hi, my name is Kat Kerr, and I love making ATCs, but I don't like spending a lot of time making them. So here are some tips to make them fast and easy and fun. Now, one of the reasons why I love making ATCs is because you can make them in a short amount of time. So my first time saving tip is use your old mono prints. Cut them down to two and a half by three and a half, which is the ATC size. And now you have a large assortment of ATC backgrounds ready for you to start working on. My next tip is to use a stencil with multiple designs. Today I'm using my new Stencil Girl ATC stencil and it has nine different designs, but you can use any stencil that has a lot of variation and pattern. My next tip is to not think about color. Don't worry about which colors to use. Instead, use the colors that are already on your palette. They might even be on your table already. My only suggestion is that you start with your cool colors first. Trust me, some of these will work and some of them won't. The goal is to just get started and to work on multiple ATCs at a time. When you work on multiple ATCs at once, you can create so quickly and you're doing it without really thinking. So you're just having fun and playing. Now, when it comes to your color palette, it's also a great idea to work with a small palette. So I started with these cool colors and here I mixed a little bit of titanium white with one of the colors just to give it a different shade, but I'm still working with the same color palette. Another tip is to create organic shapes using a thin round brush. Now that my ATCs are completely dry, now I'm going to add a warm color and I'm gonna pick just one color that was on my palette already and I'm going to apply it to the ATCs and then I'll add some titanium white to it and add it again through the stencil. My next tip is to add highlights and do some mark making with a black fine tip permanent marker and then I switch over to a white sharpie. Now for the focals, I chose one book page that had multiple birds on it, and then I cut them out and I applied one bird to each ATC. Again, I'm keeping it simple. I finished up the ATCs by using that white Sharpie again, adding a title, and these are done. Creating ATCs is a fun, easy, and fast way to release some of that creative energy. But the best part for me is giving them away. Make sure you check out the wonderful assortment of ATC stencils over at stencilgirlproducts.com. Thanks for watching.